Uh, call, are you are you calling on me? Uh, am I allowed to talk? Okay, I got the floor. All right, Stevie Mitchell, uh, big technical fall win tonight. You're a fringe guy. You're right on the, the the edge of being, you know, right in there to be a for sure guy that's going to bring a spot to the the Mid American Conference. I see, I'm, I'm seeing you like a 30, 33 to 28 type guy. What do you got to do to put yourself in the top 20? I mean, I saw the win over Jerome Robinson. You know, what do you got to do to pick up more wins like that and get the quality wins to get you to the NCAA tournament? Um, I think uh, I got some quality matches coming up with Eastern and Central and uh, Edinburgh, I think. And uh, if I just get some good quality wins there, then I think uh, that'll put me through. Your brother was an All-American here. How much does that drive you? Your brother was sixth uh, at 133 pounds. But what does that drive you and how does that motivate you to, to be the best you can be here at Kent State? Um, he's been a big influence on my life and he still continues to push me and watch, still watch my matches and tell me what I'm doing wrong. And, and so it's been huge to have him follow him. So it's been good. All right, you guys uh, moving into this, coming into the OU rivalry. You've never lost to him. You came out and you, you really got the, the, the ball rolling. You know, you followed Dustin after a fall. Did you ride the momentum of Dustin and, and get that tech fall tonight? Um, yeah, but I think it was just, just I just wanted to beat OU. You know, they're our rivals and just wanted to put on a show and just show what, I, what I'm really capable of doing too. All right, you moved down from 133 pounds last year where you were totally undersized. Now you're a pretty good, you're all right sized 25 pounder. How's the weight cut going for you and how much different is the frame and dealing with the horsepower of the other guys? It's a big difference. Those guys were a lot bigger and I was, wasn't was cutting any weight. But uh, being at 25 is where I should have been at, but I had Bedley in front of me. And working out with him has been a great help too because he was a two-time All-American. So. At 25, I just feel more confident, and I feel like that's where I need to be. What do you got to do between now and uh, you know March, the Mid American Conference Tournament, to find yourself in Des Moines after the Mid American Conference Tournament? Not watching, but in a singlet. Just keep plugging away in practice. Just keep working hard. I'll work my opponents and work on the things that I need help with. Five years here. How have your five years been here at uh, Kent State? Uh, it's been up and down. It's been out of not in the starting lineup and at 133, but all in all, it's been great. It's been a great experience. Was it the right choice? Oh, for sure. Are right, you got anything else for me? Uh, that's it. I just got a couple questions for you, Stevie. Um, when I saw you in the Northern Illinois match, that was uh, January 18th, or, it would, or December 18th, rather, and that was about a month ago, and you had a dominating performance there like you did today, but you seemed a little bit tentative in the Northern Illinois performance, but today you seemed like there was no holding you back and you just went after it. So. What do you think has changed from then to now for you? Um, just confidence, man. Uh, from there, I don't know. I just felt different. And then after wrestling this weekend and wrestling, beating Jerome and coming to overtime match with uh, Garnett, who was ranked fourth in the country, it just uh, boosted my confidence for sure. And I knew that tonight I was just going to come out with that same intensity. And you've had, uh, you spent your five years here at Kent, and you know you're not going to have too many opportunities to wrestle here anymore. So. How did it feel going out for your true uh, first home dual meet of the season this year? It was awesome. Um, I wanted to wrestle first. I was upset when they draw. I was uh, hyped from the beginning of it, so it was really cool just to wrestle in front of all those people to beat OU. Okay. Anything else for me there, Alejandro? That's it. All right. Thanks for Peace the time. And love. Peace and love. <laughs> yeah.